how to work with document component in Joomla first install it so you have to install it first you have to log in in your website then you can install it uh, according to your install uh, extension installs upload package then go here and um, here is uh, you will see document here you just have to install first xmen then you will install document after install it you will get a option like this one I mean document and uh, you just go here If you go here until you create a category you will not uh, you, go, uh, you are not showing these options so you just have to go category then you just have to uh, create a new category click new then put a title and uh, then just click save and close you don't have to put it, uh, put it those if you if you wish to put it those you don't actually not no, don't need it you just have to just put a title then uh, you just uh, the, uh, uh, you can uh, download I, I'm showing you so first I have to down uh, delete those files one minute so these are the files so you can delete it too so that I can create uh, again so let me deleting them one minute maybe first delete it from here uh, yes this one this is the deleted files and if you check these files uh, these are deleted so we can uh, find out uh, is if really our files are deleted or not okay so actually okay so leave it um, uh, we can confirm it later so you can add a new uh, file I mean uh, you can add a new file for like uh, already you have created a category then you just click documents you just uh, put a, your document name like I will put new document new doc and I can uh, choose any category if you want to make many category uh, other categories you can add this you just then create uh, upload and drag files there you can easily do it uh, here is the root folder it shows that so I will just go for my documents one minute so here is the documents and I will try to again upload this one and just start uploading yes. this one the documents is already showing off so I just uh, click uh, publish save and close and it will automatically show my documents it is automatically and it shows that it is published too and if you check this you will see documents here and uh, here are some other options you don't have to need the, those as I have uh, as uh, they have no use of it uh, like if you go options it shows you that where these files are uh, located and uh, file size will be 64 megabyte maximum and create thumbnails i mean uh, whenever you d upload a files it will show a thumbnails uh, for your for for your files so these 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 are not actually needed you just have to just uh, make categories and uh, do upload documents according to that categories this all then uh, i have already created a page for you uh, let me show you uh, about us and member page for member page it is a restricted uh, i mean restricted page until you um, uh, i mean login you cannot download uh, files you just have to login first you have to uh, give an and i will show you how to make a user uh, member you just go here users and then click manage i'll create a user account and just click new uh, we will create a demo account d e m o you just have to First, put a name, then login name. Actually, this is the username demo. Then you just put a password. I will put like demo one two three four. You just put yours one demo one two three four. So uh, you just I will give an an email gmail dot com. 
I am not keeping any registration option so that you can do it manually uh, for if any of your uh, user you need to create you just do it manually uh, then you just have to um, assign user groups so it is it will be registered basic settings okay okay everything is right so you just click save and close don't save so our user is ready now you can use this user to enter the login page like demo demo and after he log in he will find out uh, your uh, files yes here is the files you see new doc he can easily download it by clicking on it after clicking he will get through this space and you just if he click it he can able to download uh, this mills files you see it's very easy to download so this is how uh, you can create an user and uh, for your company and you just uh, make uh, him uh, to download this files and he, after download he can just have to log out for log out you just have to member page again and after member page you just have to log out and we can easily log out through on top two but i don't care of about it and after he log out he will redirect to contact us space or if you wish to keep the same page it is also possible so it depends on uh, you um, that who is on you need uh, this is the this is the action actually uh, need for clients uh, so this is how i um, disabled it i hope you understand how to create a user uh, for your company and assign them to member page and this is how this is working and uh, i hope you love this tutorial and uh, thank you for watching take care bye bye one thing more uh, if you have any question you can ask me on fiverr thank you again take care bye bye